Chapter 1497, Dragon Energy, Now Moxian looked at Lin Ming, a feeling of disbelief filling her features as they finally passed through that array diagram just now, like this, with their divine transformation realm cultivation, they had passed through the array diagram created by the Azura Roadmaster, and there were still 35 array diagrams, three of which were empty, in other words, there were still 32 of them, we don't need to pass through all the array diagrams, Lin Ming said, the God Beast Tomb Array formation was divided into three levels that surrounded the center position. As long as they could break through three levels of array diagrams, they could reach the center of a God Beast Tomb Array formation. And during these last seven years, Lin Ming had been carefully researching three array diagrams in careful detail. He didn't have time to analyze the others. These three array diagrams belong to Essence, Energy, and Divine. The second array diagram that Lin Ming chose was Body Transformation, Nine Stars. This array diagram was the one Lin Ming was most familiar with. It was part of his cultivation system. The dark gray array diagram floated still within the universe. In the center of this array diagram was a massive dragon skeleton. This skeleton was pitch black and shined with a metallic sheen, seeming as if it were made from divine iron. It was thousands of miles long and its four dragon claws rose like mountains. Two wings rose up from its back, seeming as if they could conceal the stars. A single fierce and mighty horn extended high from its head, shooting up like a divine sword. Looking at this dragon skeleton, Lin Ming's mind turned cold. From this skeleton, Lin Ming could feel an aura similar to that of the Black Dragon Sovereign he met within the Eternal Demon Abyss. If he wasn't wrong, then this dragon was the same kind as the Dragon Sovereign within the Eternal Demon Abyss. In this universe there were all types of god beasts, and even the dragon race themselves were divided into dozens and hundreds of variations. But, although Lin Ming had browsed through numerous ancient texts, he had only ever met this type of dragon in the Eternal Demon Abyss. Now, it was his second time seeing one. What type of dragon is this? Lin Ming asked Zhao Moxian. Zhao Moxian was the descendant of a god beast and her understanding of god beasts naturally surpassed his own. However, Zhao Moxian shook her head, saying, I don't know. There are great differences between the god beasts of the 33 layered heavens. I only understand the god beasts of the divine realm, and many god beasts are variation species from ancient times. There are even some that originate from before the last great calamity so there is no record of them in history books. Before the last great calamity? Lin Ming was startled. How is that possible? The last great calamity occurred billions of years ago. There shouldn't be any life form capable of surviving for such a long time. In this universe, whether it was an empyrin or god beast, they had a limited lifespan. Even if they entered a time enchantment to slow down time relative to the outside world, the amount they could lengthen their lives by was still limited. For instance, after 300 million years, three lives old man was also on death's door. That's right. Now Moxian nodded. But amongst the god beasts, there are those that are deeply slumbering within their eggs and have yet to hatch. Or, for some unknown reason they have been sealed away for a long time, so it wouldn't be strange in that situation if they managed to survive the great calamity too. As Moxian explained, Lin Ming became aware, so that's how it was. Indeed. He had heard of god beast eggs being sealed for countless years but still being able to hatch out a god beast afterwards. As Lin Ming was pondering this, he suddenly felt something move within his inner world. Lin Ming was startled. He carefully probed with his sense and impressively discovered that the overflowing black dragon energy within this array formation was gathering into an invisible current and flowing towards him. Could this be? Lin Ming had a thought about what was happening, and his guess was confirmed in the next moment. This dragon energy was being dragged into his inner world by some strange force, forming a gray spiral. And... At the end of this gray spiral was the dragon egg that the dragon sovereign from the eternal demon abyss had given him. The black dragon egg was covered with strange and mysterious runes that were slowly flickering. The dragon energy was being breathed in by the dragon egg. The dragon egg is absorbing the dragon energy here? Lin Ming was stunned. In this map of 33 array diagrams, each array diagram had a complete god beast skeleton sealed within. These god beasts were not ordinary god beasts, but the most powerful kind of their bloodline. Since they died, numerous billions of years had passed, but beneath an arrangement of the Azura Roadmaster's array formation, their skeletons had yet to lose their vitality. In fact, beneath this array formation's revitalizing powers, they seemed to become increasingly strong, as if they were going revive at any moment. These god beast skeletons were top treasures, but because of the array formation, Lin Ming simply didn't want to touch them. However, he didn't think that the dragon egg within his inner world would use some strange and unknown method to swallow the dragon energy here. Was it because they were both from the same race? But, coming from the same race couldn't be the only reason, because Amoxian was a phoenix descendant and yet she hadn't been able to absorb the energy of a god beast in the last array diagram. From this, Lin Ming could speculate that the Eternal Demon Abyss Dragon Sovereign might share an extremely close relationship with the Black Dragon in this array diagram. There was even a chance that they were similar ancient variation species. All sorts of thoughts flashed through Lin Ming's mind. He didn't hurry forwards, but instead sat down on this array diagram and began to meditate. Slowly, the dragon energy gathering towards Lin Ming began to condense. Most of the dragon energy was absorbed by the dragon egg, but a small portion remained in Lin Ming's inner world where it fused with his body. The traces of dragon energy were compatible with Lin Ming's meridians and blood vitality, joining with him and becoming a permanent part of his flesh and bloodline. The black dragon energy blended together with the azure dragon bone, bringing great benefits to Lin Ming. The azure dragon bone that Lin Ming absorbed before, although it had a rich blood energy within its thousand foot length, in truth lacked a trace of life force. After all, it was from a dragon skeleton and it was extremely different from a living azure dragon. And now, the black dragon energy that Lin Ming absorbed was also absorbed from bones. It was no different from the energy of a living true dragon. 
Lin Ming could hear small popping sounds through his body as his mortal body rapidly strengthened. Beside Lin Ming, now Moxian also noticed this. She saw a massive amount of god beast energy gathering into a vortex around Lin Ming and then disappearing from sight. Behind Lin Ming, the phantom of a black dragon appeared, clawing at the air. How could this be? Now Moxian was startled. Lin Ming could actually use the god beast energy here? At the first array diagram, now Moxian had probed the phoenix energy there, but that was the energy of a fire phoenix, whereas Moxian was a dark phoenix descendant. The fire phoenix energy brought with an insufferably arrogant aura that simply wouldn't submit to anyone. At the second array diagram, the black dragon energy was also similar to the fire phoenix energy. But for some reason, Lin Ming was actually able to absorb it. Time passed. Lin Ming closed his eyes in meditation, motionless. Now Moxian peacefully waited on the side. She was well aware that such a lucky chance could only be encountered through a stroke of fate. The dragon energy within this array diagram was as vast as the endless sea, but the dragon egg within Lin Ming's inner world had yet to hatch, so the amount of energy it could absorb was limited. After four hours passed, the dragon egg finally stopped absorbing the black dragon energy. At the same time, Lin Ming's mortal body had reached the saturation point of absorbing too much black dragon energy. As his eyes opened, he clenched his fists, causing popping sounds all over his knuckles. My aid in her hidden gates has reached the limit of limits. A sharp light flashed through Lin Ming's eyes. He could feel that his body seemed to contain too much strength as if it wanted to break through the shackles of the eight inner hidden gates. However, some invisible rule was hindering this breakthrough. This is the heavenly Tao rule that blocks the eight inner hidden gates. Lin Ming faintly frowned. It was impossible for him to break into the nine stars of the Tao palace from just absorbing this dragon energy. Within his inner world there was still the grandmost spirit bead essence that he had yet to use. During his time in Primordia's heavenly palace, he had only used a small portion of it. Most of the essence had been saved for later. Once he gained enough accumulations, he would use it to break through the chains of the heavenly Tao in a single try. Lin Ming felt that this time was approaching. If Empyrean Primordius was able to break into the nine stars of the Tao Palace, then he himself shouldn't have a problem. Although the heavenly Tao placed shackles on him, that didn't mean there was no road to take. When Lin Ming stood, the dragon energy on the array diagram seemed to be stirred up by him. The black dragon phantom behind Lin Ming shot into the sky, making several circles before it flew back into Lin Ming's body and submerged into his inner world. In that moment, within Zhang Moxian's eyes, Lin Ming's aura seemed to experience a great change. At the start, Lin Ming's aura was swift and fierce, powerful like a divine spear. But now, while Lin Ming's aura was similar to how it was in the past, it included a faint pressure, the atmosphere of an emperor, making him seem like a king. Not just that, but Lin Ming's body also had a strange yang energy, bringing with it a strange attraction for her. 